Okay, I just wanted to mention this real quick. I just found out about this today. Um, as many of you know, uh, I'm very particular about uh, a certain story that happened in the Spider-Man universe. And um, I'm not going to rehash the complete story I did on the uh, pregnancy of Mary Jane. But for those that are interested, I'm going to have a link right here to that video I did about a year ago. Uh, it'll explain everything in detail for those of you who uh, are not familiar with that story and my uh, particular rant I had on it. But basically, uh, what happened was in Spider-Man back in 1996, there was a story involving Spider-Man and Mary Jane. They were married and they were going to have a daughter. Mary Jane was pregnant. And what happened was the Green Goblin basically forced Mary Jane to have a miscarriage. Uh, her baby was born dead, or at least that was what it was implied. In later storylines, this idea was removed completely out of the continuity of, of the Spider-Man universe. And later, of course, they got rid of uh, Spider-Man and Mary Jane's marriage. They dissolved it, they got rid of it, they destroyed it. At one time, they removed it from the continuity, and later they put it back in, but they had them as divorced. And that is the way they are right now, divorced and not seeing each other. Uh, at least that's what I've heard. However, today, this image showed up. Uh, Marvel, for yesterday, you know, was going on about all the movies they were releasing. And this was about their comics, the Spider-Man comics. And all it says on the top here, uh, you can't see it, but it says, Spider-Man, renew your vows. And all you see is Mary Jane and Peter Parker, but we also see a little girl by the name of May, Spider-Man's daughter. Well, this sent shockwaves through my body when I saw this picture and I saw this little preview they had. It says, coming in the summer of 2015, Spider-Man, renew your vows. Uh, I'm blown away. They're not releasing, of course, any more details than that. They're not saying what this is or what it will be about. But, of course, with the, with the title, Spider-Man, renew your vows, and you have a picture of not only him and Mary Jane, but their daughter, what are you left to conclude? I never thought I would live to see the day. I never thought they would do this. But could it be, could it be that they're bringing back not only Spider-Man and Mary Jane's marriage, but they're going to bring back the baby, the daughter that was killed off way back in 1996. I'm I'm blown away. I don't know what to say. I, I'm trying not to get my hopes up here too much. I'm, I'm not, you know, breaking out the champagne and dancing up and down, you know, on the stairs, yelling, hey, everybody, wonderful news, but... Because we don't know yet what's going to happen or what this storyline is going to be, but my word, with a title, you know, Spider-Man Renew Your Vows, and not only that, they've got his daughter back. Could they? Could they actually be bringing her chi the child back? Not only their marriage, but the child back. If so, and this is a very big if, this will make me read Spider-Man again. And I, I can't tell you. Ever since 1996, I have been waiting for this moment. And this is a moment that I thought would never come. And I've got to be careful because, you know, I may be setting myself up for a real big fall and a real big disappointment when 2015 comes around and this story isn't exactly what I thought it would be. But I'm definitely going to be keeping up with what's happening in Spider-Man from now on. Especially when 2015 rolls around. And, uh, so, many, so many unanswered questions, so many possibilities are running through my mind. It, are they going to simply, uh, you know, put, you know, rewind the universe and have uh, Mary Jane's daughter always being alive, his, Peter Parker's daughter always being alive, and having that event in the Clone Saga where the Green Goblin killed her, having that be, you know, taken out of continuity and never happened? Or are they going to bring back the pregnancy before we see the child? You know, are they going to get back together and uh, Mary Jane's going to go through the pregnancy again and we're going to see, you know, see her pregnant? That would be great. Uh, or are the are we just going to see an issue where all of a sudden, you know, Spider-Man's there and they're married and, the, you know, the child is back, you know, and without very any, any real explanation? I don't know. Ah, so many things are going through my mind. Obviously, what I would like to see is, however they do this storyline, whatever's going to happen, I would like to see, you know, the Mary Jane pregnancy done right uh, and done well. Uh... I would like to see them do that, but of course, if not, I'm more than grateful 
to see Spider-Man and Mary Jane not only back together but with their daughter. That would be great because this is a storyline, people, that has haunted me, literally bothered me since 1996. That's a long time. This is one of the most depressing storylines I have ever had the misfortune of reading because it was, Spider-Man was a personal uh, hero of mine, you know, a childhood hero of mine. Uh, I explained all this, you know, in, in the pregnancy of Mary Jane and everything. And like I said, I'll you can look that video up. But as you know, anybody who has seen that video knows that this storyline upset me very, very badly. And uh, when they finally dissolved the marriage and everything, I finally stopped reading the comic. And I haven't read it since. If it's coming back, people, there is hope again in the universe. There is hope. Now, I, now I, I, I gotta be careful that this may not be the case. You know, Marvel might be pu pulling a very bad joke on all of us, and I shouldn't get too excited. But you can't help but get excited after seeing something like this. Uh, so... But I just had to share my thoughts real quick on this and everything. I, I didn't see this coming. Uh, I don't think anybody else did either. But um, so many possibilities. I hope, oh dear heavens, I hope we get to see uh, Mary Jane and Peter Parker back together. I hope we see the pregnancy again. I hope we see his daughter back. Uh, you know, from this cover, th that, is, that looks like what might be happening. Uh, and uh, so everybody just keep your fingers crossed. And uh, please, you know... Uh, try to keep up with what's happening with Spider-Man because there may be a good pregnancy storyline that we may need to keep up with here uh, in in the coming year, 2015. So we might want to keep up more with what's happening with the comics, even if you're not a comic book reader. And uh, for those of you who are, let's uh, share some information on here and make sure we get as many details as possible. Uh, and you know what? It, it wouldn't hurt either to uh, email or write into Marvel that uh, you would like to see you know, not only Spider-Man's marriage back, but you would like to see the baby back, you know, uh, uh, get Spider-Man's daughter back and the family together again. Uh, this, w this would be great. Like I said, so many possibilities, so many questions I have, and I don't even know where to begin. Whew, I gotta tell you. Um, I just hope, I just hope they bring her back. I hope they bring Mary Jane back. I hope, I hope they bring the baby back. <laughs> this would be great. And, I, oh, I hope we get to see the pregnancy. Um, which reminds me, I said about a year ago in that video uh, regarding the pregnancy of Mary Jane that there wasn't much to see. That's actually not true. In fact, here is a, uh, a photo from a comic book, a still I took from my comic book collection, actually. Um, this is issue 9, back in 1996, just before Revelations uh, occurred. Uh, this is the issue where uh, Spider-Man actually found out, Spider-Man and uh, Mary Jane found out that they were going to have a baby girl. Uh, it's, as you can see, it's a very good uh, very good uh, artwork, very good artwork of her pregnancy, I think. It's, it's the best, really, you could get in the 90s. Like I said, you didn't see much of uh, things like pregnancy in the 90s done very well, if you saw them at all. So, I think it's very good. But like I said, if they are going to bring back the baby, I, I hope they, the daughter, I hope they bring back, you know, the pregnancy aspect, you know, uh, this time you wouldn't have to worry about the clone saga being in the way and the Green Goblin and all that kind of crap. Uh, but then again, you know, I'm trying not to get my hopes up too much because Marvel has had a way, especially with when it comes to Spider-Man, of destroying my hopes for this character. They have a long history of treating Spider-Man badly, and they treat Mary Jane even worse. A lot of people in Marvel absolutely hate Mary Jane and do not want Spider-Man to be married at all, much less have a child, which is why I'm so skeptical and so stunned uh, by this announcement that they're going to, you know, this renew your vows and having uh, Mary Jane there and his daughter, uh, you know, they're bringing them back. I mean, that's one thing I thought Marvel would never, ever, ever do. So... If they do it, I mean, I'm gonna. This this will renew my faith in Marvel after years and years of Marvel letting me down and letting a lot of people down. I think in terms of their storylines and how they treat their characters, especially how they treat Spider-Man. Um, they need to do this. This is a story they definitely need to do. Bring back Mary Jane and please, please bring back the baby. Bring back this family. Spider-Man deserves a chance to have a family. You will have more interesting stories. And I hope, and I pray also, 
that maybe they'll bring back the pregnancy aspect with that, you know, and let's have, go through that with Mary Jane and see what that's like. That would be wonderful. But right now, I would settle just for, you know, having Mary Jane and Peter Parker back together and having their daughter back. It would be wonderful. So anyway, like I said, I just wanted to share this news and get this out there because I just found this out today like a lot of people. And again, we don't have a lot of answers. There's a lot of questions, and we don't know very much. But this could be, maybe, just maybe, the beginning of something good, finally, for Spider-Man after decades and decades and decades of bad, bad storylines and depressing storylines. Uh, I hope this is true. I hope they bring back Mary Jane I hope they bring back the baby. This is what we need. And it's definitely something I need. Because, let me tell you, that storyline back in 1996 really put a mark on me. Uh, it's it's the one storyline that I read that was just so awful and so depressing. It just ruined my faith in, um, in Spider-Man and in Marvel Comics in general. So... Until this comes around, keep your fingers crossed and uh, you know, let's hope uh, Marvel Comics for once does the right thing. Anyway, I guess that's it for now, everybody. But thanks for tuning in, and I'll try to keep up with this uh, ongoing development. This is the Chipmunk, and we will see you later. Bye, everybody.